Hello gorgeous, welcome back to Life in Style. Today's video is going to be a haul. I haven't done one in quite some time and I had a bunch of things on order and I decided to just hold everything together um, to be able to haul this stuff for you. I love filming hauls, I love watching hauls. Sometimes I'll watch hauls that I've already watched just because I love watching them. Um, I just like love the crinkle of the paper as people are opening up things and um, just showing what they got and, and what's in vogue and what they like and shops that they recommend and that sort of yeah, thing. I'm excited Absolutely. to bring all of this stuff to you, so let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing we have is an order from Rose Colored Days. Um, during a couple of Plan With Me videos, I was saying that I had to order some more of the uh, YouTube script stickers and finally got around to doing that. I really loved her script stickers um, because of the font and her bags are always so, so cute. They've got her signature bow on them, which I think is so adorable. You also get her um, business card there with all of her information. I'm not sure if, there we go. I just wanted to make sure because of that gold foil, but then you have all of her um, social media handles there. So really nice um, quality on that card. Then uh, on this, in this order, I received the full box overlays that you see here as a sample, which I'm really excited to use. I think I have some of her overlays, not these specifically, but I do have a few and also I believe bottom washi overlays. So those are in silver foil as you can see and they're on really nice paper, although they are clear, but the paper feels nice and substantial. All right, so let's go through these um, sheets that I have here. I can get them out. Um, one more thing that I got, um, and I haven't used it obviously, but it's uh, an August monthly calendar, obviously that you can put into a, um, planner, whether you want to clip it or uh, punch it or whatever, and that's in rose gold uh, foiling there, which is very, very pretty. I haven't put it into anything, like I said, but maybe I will today, so we'll see. So that came also with that order. Okay, so here are the YouTube scripts that I always talk about, and I ordered a few sheets and also some mini heart checklists, which I've really been liking more and more as I'm um, kind of on this planner journey. I have said before that I don't necessarily like the full box checklist just because um, sometimes I feel like they take up too much space or I'm not gonna use them all. So the first um, sheet I have here, the YouTube, YouTube scripts, as you can see, it's film, edit, and upload. Uh, let's see, what is this? This is rose gold, I believe. <laughs> Every, after a while, they just all mesh together. So this is rose gold right there. This one is, oh, actually this one is a purple foil. I don't know if it was lavender or what. And I don't know if I have, I'm trying to see if I have the, uh, <sighs> sometimes they send you an invoice. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so I do try to keep these. So it was rose gold, this is lavender, which is very, very pretty. Uh, let's see what else did I get okay so those are the only two that I got for the video filming um, uh, stickers and then I got three sheets of the mini heart checklist like I said I've really been loving these and three for me is usually a good number and if I need to use another one then I will so I have that also in uh, lavender I have it in silver and I have it in rose gold so that is my small but very happy order from Rose Colored Days. So next I actually have two separate orders from Paper Muse Crafts. Uh, this was part of a $2 Tuesday and I was so excited that I saw these available. Um, you guys know if you've watched my last uh, several Plan With Me videos, I have been in love with confetti dots. I used this the first time with one of her kits and I was like, I need to find out if she sells them separately. So they're basically the same thing. I'm just going to quickly read um, through the receipt here. So we've got, they're all confetti dots. We've got um, floral with gold, floral with rose gold, floral with silver, gray with rose gold, pink blush with gold, rose gold, and silver. And I basically kind of did the same thing on the second order because um, I did like the choices that I made the first time. So in both of these orders, I received these two freebies, one with each order. As you can see, this one is pink and this one is on a bay gray background. They are silver on the gray background and then this is uh, regular yellow gold on the pink background if the stupid camera will focus. Um, so you can see, so I have heart 
uh, circle stickers uh, with hearts at the bottom and then these stickers you see up top are just like small tiny flags but they're very very pretty and a really nice useful free freebie I love when companies give you freebies that you can actually use um, so I'm just gonna go through this and like I said I read through the receipt so I'm just gonna combine these orders at this point um, but these are the confetti dots and again they were two dollar Tuesday and they are just amazing so what I usually do is I will put the dot down and then kind of off to the side but on top of the dot I'll put like a little work sticker or payday sticker or something like that um, these are just so so useful to me so like that's rose gold I'm not sure how well the camera's picking up the actual foil color um, from what I can see on like there you can see that that's yellow gold see and then I have the gray background that is uh, rose gold then I have the floral there with the silver rose and then yellow gold there and then again this is the second order so basically the same type of thing because I did like the choices I made I may have changed around like what foil was on what back background but for the most part that's what I did and I just wanted to make sure that I was like very well stocked and when she has another two dollar Tuesday um, with these I'm gonna pick up a bunch more whether or not I have run through these um, because I did get a good amount but I do use these a lot so I know that I'm going to need some as the time goes on all right so the next few orders I think I got two orders here let me make sure yep so I've got two orders um, from Sadie stickers and I am going to zoom you out just a smidgel so that you can see this fully. All right, so this is one order. I'm going to hold this to the side because there were three things in that order. And then this order I just got recently. You guys know I usually say that I order my B6 monthlies from my newest addiction and nowhere else. This was the exception. This September kit with these colors just literally blew my mind. The foil on this is a rose gold foil. And I just, I couldn't, I just couldn't look away. As soon as I saw the color combination, that blue with that blush and just, you know, hints of pink and green here, this is exactly the color palette that I have in my living room. And as soon as I saw it, I was just like, I need to have it. So I went ahead and ordered it. So that's the main piece of it. And then of course you've got date dots and other little things here. So this is the sheet with the date dots there as you could see it's on a very dark blue background with the rose gold foiling and then at the bottom there you have a couple of bow stickers which is very very pretty and then here is the part where you get um your you know days off this week finances paydays that sort of thing so this one as i notice um, on, oh no, this one has the days of the week. Sorry, I, I was going to speak too soon. So you have the days of the week there. So um, really a beautiful, beautiful kit. So I was very, very glad that I picked this up because of that color combination. And Sadie stickers anyway, the paper's gorgeous. I own several of her kits. Um, a lot of kits I have actually ordered doubles of um, because I love them so much. And um, I'm going to actually show you that second order now that has the kits that I ordered. Uh, okay, so all of, well, not all of them. Two of these are B6 kits, and the reason why I love the B6 kits is that they are smaller in size for a B6 um, situation, and the boxes are also smaller, and I'm going to show you that against a regular kit. So I'm going to take this one out of the plastic as well so the you won't get too much glare, but I did end up ordering this one in just like a regular Erin Condren type of thing um, and not a B6 kit. But again, if you look at the boxes, you're going to see the difference there that vertically they're going to be a little shorter. This is the B6 kit. This is going to be a little shorter than your regular, um, again, let's say something you're going to use in an Erin Condren. The size across or horizontally is going to be the same size, but it's just going to be shorter because usually inserts um, in TNs and that sort of thing are going to be smaller, um, you know, vertically. So I love the fact that the uh, boxes are just a little shorter than your regular sized kit so let me pull quickly if I have I think I do have I do have it okay so let's see which one is this one ah okay they, they already have the names on them 
So the other thing I love about her B6 kits is that they come almost like a little packet. So if you wanted to carry this around with you, you absolutely could. Everything is, you know, stays together. So this is called Stay Cozy. This is done in a gold foil. I was not able to pick the foil, and I believe most of her kits are like that, which is fine, because I love them anyway. The paper is gorgeous and buttery, really pretty. And I loved the fact that this not only had um, pastel colors, but it had other darker colors kind of sprinkled throughout. So you have your full boxes here, you get um, eight of them, then you get a sidebar checklist there, let's see, and you could absolutely use this for a menu on the side there, like your dinners, because it does have seven bows. Two habit trackers, a bill due, you have some um, short bottom washi here, which is, again, it, it's perfectly um, tailored to fit in a B6. Then you have several checklist flags. You have some little flags here with that gorgeous sprinkling of that foiled confetti and little bows. Then you have a bunch of quarter boxes, uh, quarter appointment boxes. You have four half boxes. These are, let me see, is this another full box or is this, I'm trying to see. Okay, so these are, um, like glitter headers if you wanted to put them over the full boxes. So that is a B6 kit from Sadie Stickers. If you've never seen it before, that's what it is. And again, it's one of those things where you're not going to need really thick bottom washi unless you use it. But this is perfect. I tend to use an entire kit of these. These usually are the things that are left behind but everything else absolutely um, can be made use of. And it doesn't necessarily just have to be in a B6. You can use it in any planner you want, um, but these are specifically, again, tailored for the B6 where your full boxes are gonna be a little shorter um, and you're not gonna get as much stuff as in a full kit. So let's take a look at the next B6 kit that I also got from Sadie Stickers. Uh, whenever she has a sale, and even then sometimes not, I believe on her Instagram, you can get like a code for 10% off on any order, but whenever she has sales, I definitely go and, you know, rack up as much as I can. So this one is called Snuggle, and as you can see, it's going to have the, the the same layout. You've got your full boxes and your, you know, your uh, checklist flags here and the rest of them. This is absolutely beautiful. I probably have too many fall kits as it is already, um, so I am not buying too many as I did last year. I went completely just off the wall nuts with it, um, but not this year. So um, this is in rose gold, as you could see. I mean, that foiling, especially that confetti, the little bows and stars, is just sprinkled perfectly throughout. I just think she does such an amazing job as to where she's popping. Um, you know, like here, here's the hot cocoa, right, with the marshmallows, and I don't know if you could see that, but right there, let me see if I can bring this up, and it will focus so you can see it, but you've got a sprinkling of foil right there. Look how pretty that is, right? I mean, it's just those little touches that really, really um, make it look beautiful. So that is the second B6 kit called Snuggle. And like I said, I did order this one, which is called Hello Fall in its entirety as if I was going to use it for an Erin Condren. Now, you again, you can still use these boxes for a B6 insert or any insert that has usually the same. Like I use my um, uh, inserts from Jesenia Printables, and even if they're for the A6, B6, um, or whatever, um, like a, a, a personal wide rings, the inside or the, the, the layout is still the same measurements. You're just not going to have as much space as... An Aaron Condren. So I still do use full boxes of this size. It's just that I know I'm not going to have that, that much space. But these are your full boxes. This for me was the coloration. Lots of florals, as you can see. So it's not something, you know, again, if, if you're not into florals, this is probably not going to be up your alley. But for me, it was that coloring, that like um, wine color, and then you have it a little lighter in the blush, and everything was just perfectly hued, and you've got different pops of the same color. Just absolutely gorgeous. So that's why I got this kit. And then the second page here, you get um, two washi strips there. You've got some appointment labels. You've got some quarter boxes, two bill dues, two habit trackers. You have your full boxes here. You have two, three bow checklist boxes, which again, I can appreciate because I usually do not tend to use the longer one. Here you have a sidebar weekly with the days of the week. So if you want to use that for happy mail or whatever, you absolutely can do that. 
And then on this uh, third sheet here, as you can tell, you don't get in the B6 kit are all of your um, headers. So your today to do, then you have these headers here, which are floral. You can use those above your full boxes if you wanted to. You have uh, bow checklist flags, two more half boxes, a few um, functional script stickers there, some functional um, icons, the weekend banner, and then two uh, flag stickers down here. And then here you have your um, your daily headers, I completely forgot like uh, what the hell they're called, <laughs> seriously. Um, but there are your days of the week. There's some more, um, a little bigger than quarter boxes. Then you have some bow headers there at the side. Then you have your beautiful bottom washi and three flags here. Again, this bottom washi is split in half. And I know that a lot of um, shops are starting to do that more and more, which I think can be appreciated because if I wanted to use a Cine B6, I wouldn't necessarily be using the thicker um, thicker washi. Or if I was using it, let's say in an Erin Condren or a Recollections or whatever, and I do have that biggest space, I could use the bottom and use a, a favorite washi on top or use this and a favorite washi and so on and so forth. So I really think that, you know, having those split is a very, very nice idea. Um, one thing I did forget to show you is one of the, um, the freebies that I got. And these are basically foiled bow headers, which is very, very beautiful. These are in yellow gold. And I have several of these from her, and I do use them. So again, very useful freebies are always, always appreciated. So moving on, I have two orders from Sticker Bloom. Uh, if you guys watch my channel, you know for a fact that I am a Sticker Bloom junkie. I just, I love the stuff. I always say though, it does take a while to get to you, but because of the pricing, because of the quality, because of what they um, what they put out, I understand. I'm okay with that. It's not to the point of six months. I mean, it's craziness to think that. Um, but you do probably wait a good two or three weeks before you get a shipping notice. But again, I am okay with that. I've gotten used to their... Um, you know, their, their uh, schedule and they do put out their stuff very, very early because they know their schedule. So the first thing I have here is Enchanted Forest. I actually have one of these um, kits from another shop just in a different variation of the same type of clip art. So I got this um, freebie. Sticker Bloom's freebies are also really, really great. So you have a full box there. You have uh, bigger than a quarter box there, a couple of headers quarter box rounded off, actually two um, rounded off there. So this is a really nice freebie to use. I use their freebies a lot when I'm just planning for myself to kind of get through some anxiety or something because um, they do, you know, again, they do really come in handy. So this is a foiled full kit. Again, it's called Enchanted Force. I tend to just get their full foiled kits because their pricing is usually like 45 to 50% off. Their paper and their um, their rhythm with the way their kits are kind of um, done now is really, really nice. They're coming into their own with how their kits are looking, and we'll go through that as I'm kind of flipping through these pages. So as you can see, you have gorgeous foiling throughout, just sprinkled about very nicely. Um, not too much, but enough, which I really love. And this clip art, again, like I said, I have a lot of foiled, uh, not foiled, fall kits that I had from last year. I mean, I went nuts last year ordering all kinds of kits because it was really my first year ordering stuff um, where I started doing decorative planning. And um, I have a lot, but this clip art really, really spoke to me. And the colors as well, just that blush and that pink and just the different variations of same colors. So you have your full boxes there, a couple of rounded off quarter boxes up top. Then you have two habit trackers right here. You have bow checklist flags. Those are three, uh, two flags there. You have a couple of quarter boxes. These are smaller boxes there. You have smaller than a half box there with a nice scallop and a bow. You have lots of uh, functional script, some weather stickers, which are really cute. I don't think I've ever seen those before on one of their kits. Hello Weekend, you have three laptops, three televisions, uh, a planner or a journal, and then two Happy Mail stickers. They've changed this as well. I know their kits very well because I use them so much, so 
I know they've changed this. Some of their kits have these functional icons um, foiled, which I I love personally. So when I saw this, I was a little surprised, but um, maybe because they changed a couple of other things, they took the foiling off of this. Then you have some heart, he um, not heart, bow uh, headers here, which are very, very pretty. And then on the third page here, you have usually almost a full page of ombre checklist boxes. These are with bows. Then you have three rounded off half box, uh, quarter boxes, excuse me, up top. Then you have your sidebar weekly always on this page. Then the next page, you always have your bill dues. You get four, which I think is really great. A bunch of half boxes. These are usually rounded off. Then you have these cute little, um, uh, quarter boxes with little flags and bows and then these are bigger than quarter boxes your movie marquee and a bunch of flags up here then you have this page where you have um, these boxes up top which are bigger than quarter boxes you have your little things here and all of your headers to do today extras and some stuff down here um, which they always do a good good job with that so here's your bottom washi there goes that sprinkling of that beautiful yellow gold there I think that this washi is so beautiful in its simplicity where you've got green almost like brush stroke and then you've got some you know greenery there um, which I think just looks really really nice then you also have um, these boxes here that are bigger than a quarter smaller than a half these are quarter boxes and these are a bunch of washi strips here and then their glitter header page is always something to be just ugh. I mean look at it it's just so gorgeous always has that smattering of foil and I always say it even if your kit is not foiled foil your damn headers <laughs> I just think it brings something so beautiful to a kit um, and it, again this could be the only thing foiled in the in the kit and I personally would just be over the moon about it so you have those you have two uh, washi strips here you have your date covers right there which again are in that green it's it matches the bottom washi um, right there if you could see and then you have your date dots here the one thing I will say about the date dots I don't tend to use them only because they're very like the the number font is very utilitarian for me I like number font that's a little fancier so sometimes I'll use them um, but for the most part I do not use them I'll keep them and use them for any planning that I do on my own you know in the house so that is the sticker bloom kit called enchanted forest so the second order I did from them I think I ordered two kits. I told you, I'm just, I love their stuff. And I look at their website daily and I do have them on Instagram. So I'm constantly like checking out what they have. Okay, so this is the Hello Fall freebie, which I was like, yes, more overlays. So this is in yellow gold. It almost looks like a green gold. But as you can see here, these overlays are beautiful. And I know the light is probably killing it, but these right here, these are um header overlays and it just leaves and just so beautiful i love it so i certainly cannot wait to use these overlays all right so i have two or three i think two two kits so this one is called autumn mode um and for me i i just really like the cartoonish um thing about it just really really cute and the colors, of course, and the foiling, as you can see, they're just so, so beautiful. But I liked that you had, I mean, it really does feel like fall. You have a little home um, scenery there, like a wall shelf scenery, and then like an entryway scenery, the florals, the little fox and owl and stuff. And just really, really nice. It just caught my eye as soon as I saw it. So again, the, uh, the layout of the kit is going to be the same. So I'm going to run through this pretty quickly and just kind of go through it and show you. Um, but again, this is a yellow gold. Old, uh, foil on it there's a second page there these are very very light so the camera the lights are probably washing that out completely and this is very pastel so but this is the um, sidebar weekly and your checklist boxes there there's that page there half boxes movie marquee there you have your little things and your headers bottom washi just has a little bit of that foil on the floral part but I love this, this wood grain, almost like a shiplap um, motif, which is very, very cute. And of course, there's that beautiful, beautifully foiled 
header page. Gorgeous. And then these date covers are so pretty. I'm going to see if this stupid camera will focus so you can really see those. Those are so, so cute. I love it. So there is that full kit, autumn mode. So the second kit in this order is called Cozy Fall. Um, this is just a pastel lover's dream, as you can see how pretty it is. And you can see that the uh, kind of the underlying theme of what I'm liking for fall kind of looks the same um, with just this almost watercolor look to a lot of it. Um, just very simple and stuff, really pretty. So this is a yellow gold foil, as you can see there. So the pages are the same. I'm just going to run through this quickly so you can see. Um, and it is pastel, so again, the lights may be drowning some of it out. I mean, that's very light. Even as I'm looking into the viewfinder, it is very, very light. But some of these half boxes have... Um, the design watermarked or on the corners of the boxes, which I really love. Then you have your little things and your headers right there. The bottom washi page on this is beautiful. Again, just a little bit of foil over the floral, and then you have some foiled leaves, which I think is very, very pretty. And then we come to the gorgeous foiled headers. There we go. And then look at how gorgeous these uh, day covers are. I'm hoping that this camera will focus. It's very light, almost like a watercolor floral, but very, very beautiful, and I love it. So that is everything I got from Sticker Bloom. Now, my next order, put this one to the side. I'm going to save that one for last. I got from White Deer Stationery. I'm going to link every all of the shops below, um, but I love her stuff so much. She is on Etsy and um, she is in Canada, so it takes a little while for the stuff to get to me, but again, with this, I know the situation, so, and, and she ships out pretty quickly. These were already done. These were like a last chance type of thing. I think she already had these done. They shipped out, I believe, the next day, so I was very, very surprised and very happy. She always wraps up her stuff so beautifully, so this is the freebie that I got with this order, which is very, very cute. I love her colors, too. She uses these soft uh, mauves and creams and blushes. So she's got a reminder appointment urgent with love, like a little seal. A um, looks like a quarter box, but it's pretty long. And then uh, like a present um, uh, seal uh, to and from, which is very, very cute. So again, her freebies are absolutely some of my favorites because they are very, very usable. So let's go ahead and open this up. So I knew a long time ago that she also sold like the dots, like the ones that I got um, earlier, the, the, the glitter dots I was showing you. So I went looking for them and I saw that they were in the last chance and I believe they were on sale too. So I grabbed a bunch. So the first thing I grabbed here, and I, I want to say seriously that I believe all of this stuff was last chance or final stock is what she called it. So I have here, um, as you can see, little envelopes for Happy Mail, which I love. She does all her own like hand-drawn stuff, and I believe um, that's almost all her stuff. It's just so, so beautiful. So that's the first sheet. And then I've got these little separators. These are foiled in silver on clear paper. These are a little tooth for dentist appointments. Get rid of that and then these are also on clear paper these are silver i believe no these are gold they're just light um these are laptops which again i use all the time and then i also got these clear paper silver foil little paw print so whenever my babies have to go to the vat or grooming this one also on clear paper silver foil these are dollar bills for either paying a bill or a payday type of things, whichever way you want to use it. So the dots that I got here, um, these are on uh, glossy paper. Um, it's not a really high gloss, which is good because I usually tend to stick to matte paper. But again, the dots was the thing I was looking for. It wasn't what the paper finish was. So um, there's different color like colorways that she has, but I'll just show them to you. So you see like pastel pink, and this is almost like a purpley mauve, then a gray and a darker gray here. You've got kind of like a blue colorway uh, there, which is really, really pretty. Oh, you know what? The bottom has it. So this is the bunny colorway because she still has stuff. These are just final stock, but she still has stuff that uses these colorways. This is owl butterfly colorway. 
This is floral, which I love this green. It's almost like a minty green. This one is fox, which is also very pretty. And this one is called moss. So this is a little brighter um, than the pastels that I showed you. So that is my order from White Deer Stationery, but I am extremely happy to have this stuff. I have a lot of her stuff already and I love, I mean, she does such amazing work. All right, so the last thing I have here is an order from Planner Press. I was looking on Etsy and I came across the what you know like her shop and she had stuff and I'm like I want stuff so I got stuff so let's go first to kind of the I'm not gonna say boring part but just kind of a utilitarian type of thing so I am trying to really bulk up not only in size but also in style my um, personal wide rings planner that I have from print Prussian. I love the planner, but I haven't really, I haven't really given it the love that I feel it deserves. You know, if you've seen my, some of my TN setups, I really get down on decorating da dashboards and things like that. So I said, you know what, for the fall, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do a setup in my, um, PW rings and that's what I'm, that's what I'm rolling for. So I got these, um, separators basically. Um, for the uh, for the uh, uh, TN or for the rings planner and uh, this is again really just something that's kind of one of those main things that you start with for me anyway for a rings planner so that's that and then I also got to go along with that and I'll just pull one of these out are the labels so she has different options for labels not only different um topics for the labels but also different fonts and that sort of thing um and you can actually get another sticker that goes on and then this goes on that or you can put this directly on that the other stuff is kind of optional so i have like to do work bills home monthly kids personal inbox cleaning shopping this for me was tailored a little more to what my life is so i got that and this is in um gold uh, gold foil, but you can also get it in black and I believe silver and rose gold and pink or something in blue um, She has a couple of different choices, but I wanted the gold. So that's what I got. So again, these are just to go on the actual um, Separators uh, dividers. I, I was like at a loss for that these go on the actual dividers and you can just you know Set them up as you will. I'll probably get another set of the actual dividers um, again, I'm trying to bulk it up. The, the, the personal wide rings can hold a lot. So, and I, and I don't know why I'm scared to just like have it hold a lot. This is the journaling card that I got with the order, which is gorgeous. It says fall down seven times, get up eight. Love this coloration here. Really nice um, feel to it. And then it has her information on the back here. Um, and actually, you know what? I said Etsy. She used to be, either she is on Etsy as well, but she also has her own website. It's plannerpress.net, and that is where I placed this order. So more checklists because I'm, again, a little obsessed with them lately. Um, so these are uh, six heart checklists, as you could see there. Um, these are on a slightly glossy paper. They're not super gloss, but again, I'm fine with that. So I just got it in silver and uh, yellow gold for now. So those are that, um, which are very, very pretty, and I love them. And then this is where the idea came in because the size was there, the, the PW rings um, size was there, to do my setup in the personal wide rings this fall. Um, and this is kind of where the idea started taking shape with these um, beautiful vellum. And so she has them in different sizes. When I saw PW rings, I said, boom, sold. So I don't know how well you're going to be able to see them because, of course, it's vellum. But it is gorgeous with like a jean jacket and some floral there. Then you just have a beautiful bouquet of flowers there, which is very, very gorgeous. And these are on different colored vellums, which I think is really nice. This one says stay cozy. You have a um, like a cable knit um, throw, little bunny slippers. Um, that might be a window view and then a cup of cocoa, which I think is so gorgeous. Then this one is a girl with a messy bun and just one flower in the hair, which I think is so beautiful. 
Then this one says, welcome fall. You've got that same Angora, uh, not Angora, cable knit, um, throw the cup of cocoa and then a beautiful white pumpkin, which is just nice and pale and I love that. And then the last uh, vellum here, you have someone in some wellies with a cool umbrella, almost looks Burberry-like, um, over on the side. So yeah, this was really the start of the idea that I was going to give my attention to my PW rings for the fall setup. Um, and I'm glad I got them. As soon as I got them, I mean, first of all, vellum just feels so beautiful. And the fact that it's ready for the PW rings makes me feel even better. So that is the last thing that I got. Like I said, this haul wasn't horrendously big like some of my others, but it was perfect for me and I just definitely wanted to share with you. So that is going to do it for this haul video. I hope you enjoyed everything I had to show you. I certainly enjoyed hauling it for you. Love everything I got. Just looking at this like little pile and all the colors, I'm just, you don't want to wish time away, but I'm ready for the fall for crisp, you know, weather and if fall and spring for me are my favorite times of the year. If fall could just stay forever, I would be fine with that, you know, with just those nice, cool weather uh, days, but not horrendously cold and not too hot. Um, but yeah, I just love everything I got. So now I get to put everything away and use it in future videos for you guys. And um, can't wait to set up that PW rings for the fall with everything that I got from Planner Press. So stay tuned for that video in the next uh, coming weeks because I am putting everything together to make sure that that comes together beautifully. If you have not done so, please subscribe to the channel and also click that little bell so you get alerted as to whenever I upload new content. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next one. Bye.